We're actually doing a couple things. We're given an opportunity for a multi-agency response to a large incident. It's all simulated, of course, but it gives an opportunity for our first responders to work together in a coordinated fashion for a large incident, which is, quite frankly, not something that they have an opportunity to do on a regular daily basis. So it's very important that, they, that we do that to, for the practice purposes, and also it's a, it's a big puzzle to put together, essentially, to make that happen. The second thing we're doing is we're doing a, a validation of our uh, Placer and Nevada County incident, uh, oil by rail incident response guide. We're validating that. That was about a year long process to build that guide. And this exercise is one of the purposes, the, the design purposes is to validate that guide and see if it works well, if it doesn't work well, how we need to improve it. There's over 35 different agencies involved. Obviously, Roseville Fire, Roseville Police, a lot of the other fire departments, Placer County Fire, FBI, law enforcement across the counties involved. The key things that we want to learn is we want to validate our oil by rail response guide, make sure that it's good to go in the event we have to do this for real, highly unlikely event that we have to do this for real. And then it's an opportunity for our first responders to work together come together as a large team and work in a coordinated fashion. So far, so good. We always have a lessons learned or a hot wash uh, briefing afterwards to see what we did, you know, where we need to improve, what we did right, what we did wrong. It gives them an opportunity to have that in a field environment and not just a training classroom type environment.